Hi, it's Ronnie, and welcome to my channel, and a punched out Thursday to die for. And I imagine you are all dying to know who won, and it is Jennifer Early. Jennifer, you won the $50 gift certificate to scrapbook.com. So go to Kathy Feigl's channel, and uh, well, make sure you comment down there. I'd like you to comment down there if you're here first, but go to her channel, and uh, well, I'll have her email below. You can just email her there. But go to her channel and thank her too and all the other gals. But I am so happy that we had so much participation. Thank you all so much. I mean, we had loads of participation for this giveaway. And we plan on having more. But uh, yeah, go to Kathy's channel or just email her at the email address down there below. And you will get your e-gift card. Congratulations, Jennifer. And th again, thank you all so much for all the participation that we had for this giveaway. But back to what I'm doing. <laughs> Have y'all ever had one of those weeks where you just can't seem to get anything done and everything is just like helter-skelter and you're trying to do this and you're trying to do that and nothing is working out? Well, that's been my week. And I knew I had to get this video done for Punched Out Thursday, so I was trying to think of what to do. Well, I remembered this layout that I've been planning on doing forever, like at least a year, maybe longer, since I got this photo. And that photo is of my daughter-in-law. She's kind of hard to see. She's in the background. And those are three gals there are her besties. And they're at church, and you can see the church pews and the altar up there. So they're right there in the chapel part of the church. But they went to take a picture, and they didn't tell her. Well, she come over and seen that's what they were doing, so she photobombed the picture. <laughs> I thought, I've got to get that scrap. And I, I happened to think of it when I was thinking about what pictures to do. Well, I ran across the picture two or three times while I was looking at pictures, trying to think what I could do with Punched Out Thursday. And I thought, oh, I'm just going to go back and get that one. I don't have time for this. I already know what I have planned for this layout. And I can just do it in practically no time at all. And so this is a so short video. I use my dies to cut out stars. And those are stitch dies, the star ones, the big one from uh, Cat Scrappiness. And I put one inside of another so that I could have just the outline and then I'd have a solid one on the middle. And then I'm going to use, well, I'm just going to use one of my punches. I did get three punches out, but I'm only going to use one because I got to thinking, this looks really busy. <laughs> and I started to put the stars down first. And I thought, my title's pretty long. I really need to put my title down first. So that's what I'm doing. I'm putting my title down. I put the picture laid the picture there and the stars there that I knew I was going to have but uh yeah I'm working on the title and the title is when you catch your besties taking a photo without you you have to photo bomb I would have put you got a photo bomb <laughs> but I didn't have enough tees and even though I was using three sets of fonts here I was still going to come up short on T's, so I decided I would put a more correct title by You Have to Photobomb. Yeah, I had those letters, and, you know, I still had to use my last T, <laughs> but, yeah, this that's my title, and I've been planning it for a long time, so I already knew what I was going to have as my title, and I was going to have star C. Angela, the one in the middle there in the front, she's the one who did the picture. And she likes to add things to her pictures. And she added loads of stars. So there is stars on a couple of the gals' faces. And I thought, well, I'm going to go with that. And the colors I used is the ones in Angela's t-shirt. Pink and orange and yellowish color and just a hint of green. I think I might have more green than her shirt does, though. But, uh, yeah, I've been wanting to get this done for my daughter-in-law's album. I've been working on one for her. Well, I'm working on two for her. One is kind of more of a surprise than the other one is. But, uh, yeah, 
there's I'm gonna punch out one of those uh, stars there and then I'm gonna decide I need some more even though I thought it was pretty busy before I punched the first bunch out I'm gonna punch them out one more time just so I have enough to scatter throughout my layout and I really like using these stars for um, out and I like the outline well I like stars you can see I've got like three sets of punches there and then I have got these dies and I do have some more star dies I have one that's really cute but I didn't think about it till I was about halfway done with this because I ran across this one first but I've got the circles with the die I guess you'd call it maybe a little galaxy looking circle I'm not sure but I've got a couple of them I've got one bigger one and one smaller one and yeah I like using stars on boys layouts usually <laughs> yeah, I it's less often that I use them on girls layouts but I do use them on girls layouts uh, I like to use hearts on girls layouts the boys kind of look at it hearts again so I don't use hearts on theirs quite as much but the girls don't care one bit they like the hearts I am pulling the green and the yellow off of this sticker sheet and that's uh, pink fresh I love it that they put so many on theirs and you've got plenty to choose from and they got arrows on their hearts and stars so and, and I think there's some enamel dots on there too I'm not a hundred percent sure no no I don't think there is just plain round ones because I had to pull these out but all I'm going to use is the yellow and green again and I'm going to scatter them on there I thought well there's so many stars on there I need another shape so yeah a long title stars and enamel dots and that's it that's my layout but thank you all so very much for watching and again congratulations Jennifer on your win and um if uh, you leave a comment below, I'll get back with you. And if you like the video and hit a thumbs up, I'd appreciate it. And if you are not subscribed to my channel, I'd love to have you subscribe. But again, thank you all so much for all your participation. I hope you all have a happy, scrappy week. Take care and stay safe. Bye.